Come on, lad. Hello, Internet, and welcome back to Fable Anniversary Edition. Sorry, long story short, I did not realize that when you Come on, lad. quit, you had to redo certain cutscenes. So now I've walked back outside, and I'm going to talk to the Guildmaster. Are you ready? All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Also, I embarrassingly now then, forgot how to use. I want you to hit that, that dummy up. as hard as you can. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. All right. Tap space to target the dummy. Use the movement keys to circle around your target. Movement. Oh, lost. Duh. Left mouse button to attack. Not making much of an impact there, are you? Here, try with this. A little better. Ah, now that's more like it. When you destroy an enemy like this dummy, it drops an experience orb. These orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature. It's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Now pick it up. You can pick them up by holding... Ooh, that'll come in handy. Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. I'll wait for you at the guild woods entrance while you deal with the problem. Once you're done, we can talk about starting your training. Let me guess. This is going to be dealing with... So, sorry. Learned a new quest. The Beatles would be my guess. It has been so long since I've played this game. Been in the wars, Guildmaster. Where am I supposed to go? Oh! Sorry, I slip into Filipino sometimes. Specifically in this case, Tagalog. Oh boy! I still can't get over the difference in these graphics. These are amazing. Keeping in mind, I've only ever played it on the original Xbox, so I'm not familiar with Fable 2 or 3's graphics, which is what this one's graphics are based on. Um, oh, right. Let's go back out. Put you away. I don't need you anymore. There has got to be a way to run without trying to punch everything in existence. I like the script used in this world. It's Good work, cool. lad. Those beetles can be a damn Beep. nuisance. Here, I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Or you can get an early night. Um, let's go. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind, 
But soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. His days were filled with grueling exercises, the nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Mays had foreseen. The real training was about to begin. Ominous. Get out of bed, lazy bones. We were supposed to meet the guildmaster on the other side of the river, but that was an hour ago. We better get going. Race you there. <laughs> to run, press and hold. Oh. I didn't realize it was that simple. Okay. Can I jump? I don't think so. And I've gone the wrong way. Wrong way. Long way. <laughs> There's a lot more people here than I'm used to remembering. Um, where are you? Oh, there you are. Late again. You do seem to have a problem getting up, lad. In my defense, I'm on six hours sleep. And that's in reality. Let us come. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin training with real weapons now. Get used to the weight of this sword. And let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. Ooh. But you're a wizard, hero. <laughs> Come on then, let's see what you've got, farm boy. Oh. How did that get through? Come on, Dad. Hit her. Now pay attention. What I'm about to teach you could well save your life one day. The life of a hero is a dangerous one, and you must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block her attacks with your sword. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to handle anything Whisper can throw at you. <laughs> Press and hold the middle mouse. Oh, great. I might readjust that in the control settings at some point. Come on. <laughs> Come on, sweetheart. I'll hit you next time. Well done. Now let's see if you can combine attack and defense. Hello, Thunder. Ah, hello, Thunder. Come to check on your sister's progress, Man. have you? You could say that. Whisper told me you've got a training with some farm boy. Maze thinks the boy has great potential. Enough to keep up with my Whisper. Ha! <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. All right, children. Let's see who has learnt the most in their training. This will be a no-holds-barred duel. Just like your final melee test. Prepare yourselves. That's all wrong, Whisper. You need to practice more. Shame you couldn't see me fight in the arena. You might have learned a thing or two. <laughs> Keep training if you want to go there yourself one day. I could have beaten him if you hadn't stopped us. Oh, sure. We have few enough heroes as it I is. I don't think so. Without the two of you tearing each other apart in training. Speaking of which, meet me as I make my way to the archery range. When you're ready to continue your lessons. 
And this now, is and about one. your melee performance. Excellent. Fight like that in your melee exam, and you'll do well. I'm so sorry. Mm. Do I want to continue or repeat? Continue. I did well enough in melee. It's archery that the computer version controls have me at a bit of a oops. Then meet me by the archery range to continue your training. To your archery training. Man. Let's continue our training with the bow. Longbow. But you're a wizard hero. Two out of twelve. Okay, I guess I'll figure that out later. Cause yeah, I am gonna probably re be relying. To begin on with, see if you can hit magic. three stationary targets and put some effort into it. The Somewhat. longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage you will cause. But make sure you stay within the circle. That's the easy part. Okay, so Q for the sword, E for the bow. That's simple enough. You can aim your shots with a mouse or lock on by pressing space. Press and hold. Odd. I remember it being a lot different. Now, lock onto the target. You hit all the targets. I remember it being more Unfortunately, difficult. most foes don't stand still. So let's see how you fare against moving targets. You have a minute to score as many points as you can. The front target is worth one point, the middle one is worth three, and the one at the back will score you nine points. And remember, the longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage the shot will cause. More damage means more points, but you have to balance power firing rate and accuracy. Let's see what you can do. What? Oh. Switch to a first person view. Press the right mouse button while drawing it back and forth. You can zoom in and out with the mouse wheel. Ooh, that's a fun trick. Uh -huh. Come on, lad. Get your bow out. Oh, I see. Woo, this is convenient. But try firing more powerful shots. <laughs> Next, we will learn about the ways of the will. Speak to me when you're ready to continue with your training. I'll be heading to the island by the waterfalls. Like I said, archery is not my strong suit in a case like the training session. I don't use it as often. But I will be attempting to get Squarm's bow at some Any point. Any princes want to practice melee combat? 
But yeah, my go-to weapons are blades or magic. talk to you later. That demon door actually looks really cool in this graphic. Where are you, Weaver? Oh. There's just the will. That... It's time to learn about will powers. We'll begin by striking these strong dummies with lightning. Oh, I get it. I know what All right. Let's on. see what you've got. Pull and hold left shift. Oh, that makes sense, because you do that to gather those. Your power can be accessed this way. That's it. See how many you can hit in half a minute. Only attack dummies that are facing the center of the island. You won't get any points for hitting one on the back. You'll only waste valuable mana. Using your willpowers depletes your mana, and once used, it takes time to replenish. Okay. Change targets, press and hold. Press and hold. Interesting. use of magic. Well done. Very good, lad. You have learnt the three hero disciplines. We can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time exploring the guild. I believe Whisper is about to go into the guild woods, if you wish to join her. Ah, screw it. Let's just I go. hope you're ready. Truly mastering a hero's skills takes years of practice. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. For years, the guild was his home, his school, and his life. But as time passed, his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. He would receive the guild seal and be free to forge his own destiny. <laughs> he would become a hero. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Enter the guild woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. The test will be revealed to you there. Good luck. Hmm. I could have sworn that we were supposed to. Hmm. Alright, I'm actually gonna end this episode here. Well! Yeah. Oh, I just realized what time it is. Yep, I'm gonna end this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. Feel free to subscribe and click the little bell to get notified of my upcoming videos. Have a blessed day. Zanipator, out.